It's been announced that actor Samuel L. Jackson and Michael Caine will star in the upcoming film Harry and the Butler. Harry and the Butler is the true story of Harry Jackson, a one-time jazz virtuoso living in New Orleans who has given up on his dreams and now spends his days at the, as the mechanic for a derelict roller coaster and his nights in his makeshift home, a converted train caboose. When his former mentor bequeaths him a large sum of money, Harry, in a drunken celebration, decides to hire himself an aging, down-on-his-luck English butler, played by Kane, an act of impetuous generosity that changes their lives forever. Dennis, buy or sell the sounds of Harry and the butler. Uh, I'm gonna have to sell this. It sounds like those typical 80s movies that were the fish out of water. I know this is kind of like a loose remake of a 1960s Danish film, but I don't know. This just sounds like one of those like, and this got poor guy, all of a sudden he gets tons of money and then his life has changed and he learns the meaning of how money is in everything type of Bruce's movie. millions. Yeah. I don't know how you can sell this. The story of Alfred after being fired by Bruce Wayne, <laughs> now butlering for somebody else, Samuel Jackson. This is genius. No, I, I, no, that's not what the story is here. Um, I am also going to sell it, sadly enough. I, I think you're right. The first thing I thought of when I heard the description was that Richard Pryor movie, uh, Brewster's Millions. Remember that, where you mm -hmm, got yeah. all that money and something? That's kind of what it sounds like to me. But, I mean, it is basically, it is loosely based on a true story. Um, so obviously it's not going to be a wah, 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 wah comedy yeah. kind of <laughs> thing. So if it goes in a more dramatic area, then these are two great guys to do it. But we simply don't know. Right now it just doesn't sit. I'm getting this picture in my head like Dennis about some, what do I do with this $10,000? Right. You know, I'm smoking a $100 bill kind of jokes and gags. Uh, hopefully that's not what it is. But for now, for me, it's going to be a buy, Schnapp. When you get lost between the mothers. This feels like Arthur. <laughs> Arthur, little, I was going to say that. You know, honestly, I'm going to buy it because I think they're going to go serious with it. And I think it's, mm. uh, you know, the title of it is a little jokey, like Harold and the Butler. I was immediately like driving Miss Daisy and all these other kinds of things. Jake and the Fat Man. Yeah, these things <laughs> floated in my mind. But then the more I thought about it, the more since it's based on a true story, it really could just be a guy who's like, hey, you know, I've only seen, I've always seen this down on his luck guy. Maybe he, he was a butler and he's like a homeless dude in New Orleans. I don't know what the real story is, but it sounds interesting to me. Those guys are great actors and I'd love to see them act together. So to me, it's a buy. If you like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to AMC Movie News on YouTube. It's free and a great way to stay updated with all the latest movie news and check out our daily show, AMC Movie Talk. Also, don't forget to check us out on Facebook and Twitter to stay in the loop for our special prizes, giveaways, and contests.